Hope you're ready for the next episode. Hey. Hey guys, we're going to give you an update in the greenhouse today and show you how everything's growing and um, we'll see who is out and who we'll get to see. We'll feed some fish and uh, you can see the progress. Let's go ahead and I cut up some tilapia. They're just bought from Winn-Dixie and I think that um, we also get them from Walmart. box turtle enclosure and we'll see who's out and about. log on, in the water. underwater because I got the GoPro right here but I don't see anybody else out. Oh. Someone's buried right here but I don't want to bother them because they're going to end up digging deeper because uh, the box turtles they brumate so it means that she's getting ready to go to sleep for the rest of December and January and we'll see them at the end of January. Unless it doesn't get cold, maybe they won't brumate this year. I don't know, we'll just have to wait and see. Seeping along. Alright. Nobody's here. Oh, there's somebody. Hey, honey. All right, so we're going to check out the water in a minute, but look at what I just found. Great. If you want to know more about the white pasty stuff that comes out of a tortoise, there'll be a link in the description. And now we're going to check on Sparky underwater. Thank you. 
we have guppies in this um, pond, and in all of our ponds we have live fish, and that helps us take care of mosquitoes, and it gives live food source to all the animals all the time, anytime they want it. Plants are a live food source too, so we usually have duckweed and such, but they like to eat it. Let's check out the pink belly snapper that's underneath this piece of wood right here and see what he's doing underwater. Enclosure is a uh, Indonesian turtles. We have the Malaysian box turtle. Coria ambienensis, or the Malayan box turtle. You'll find this turtle listed as vulnerable on the IUCN red list. It's also registered on CITES. CITES is the Convention of International Trade in Endangered Species of Wild Fauna and Flora. In which we just told a story about how we acquired these. Billy side neck. This enclosure is um, African mud turtles. Um, they're the which species? They're the ones without a hinge. The cutest. They have a lot of personality for sure. Enclosure is the other African mud turtles. And we have a lot of mosquito fish in this pond. No guppies, I don't think. And let's see. There are about 10 turtles in this enclosure, and you can't see a single one. Him. Let me know if you see them because I don't see any. They do, they hide so well. Let's check underneath this log. Hello, anybody under there? Maybe this log. they'll come out when we bring food. This pond its black marsh turtles. It's a pretty good enclosure. They seem happy. They're very elusive and shy. This enclosure is pink belly side neck turtles. Try to catch them, but they are elusive as well.
this enclosure is where Bullet and Raphael Cody, Cody or Kobe, Raphael, Bullet, uh, the full-grown yellow belly females. In other words, this is a Florida native species enclosure, and this is where the alligator snapping turtle also lives. In which case, we definitely brought food for today. So let's go get it and check him out. He's hiding in that mud. Right there. Uh, can't see him now. Want some fish, sweetheart? Well, you guys saw me. I tried my best to get the alligator snapping turtle to eat, but he's not hungry today. So everybody else got pizza fish and and then also his pieces of fish. So it's a good day for, for this group. What we can do is we can try to see if the... Um, oh, those rocks. No, those are not rocks. Are they rocks? Yeah, I thought they were eggs. You have to admit, they do look like eggs. Alrighty. So anyways, what we'll do is we'll see if the soft shell wants to eat some of this fish. Cut up tilapia. Try. Look. There's a frog. That's how we keep uh, tadpoles always in here. I don't know. Can you guys see it? There, I think. Anyways, let's see if the soft shell is under here and... Oh, there he is. I even see him. See him under the water right there? Alright, let's see if he'll get started. That was cool to feed him underwater, but let's see if we can get him up on the land and feed him some fish.
These guys are under quarantine. This is just quarantine so we can watch that they're eating and they're pooping. That one actually dropped his fish. Let's see if we can. Find it. Come on, buddy, you want to eat? Awesome. These guys are doing really, really good. Well guys, today we're going to give you guys, uh, no, I said guys twice, so let's start back over here.